the day I went missing. Was the day I died. Oliver Queen is alive. Oliver, what happened to you out there? Dad? Survive. No! These were five years! Five years! Where nothing good happened. The entire time that I was gone, I could never completely trust someone. And when that goes on for so long, you stop seeing people for people. You see threats or targets. And when I decided to come home, I just didn't know how to turn that part of me off. You haven't returned home because you feel you're a monster. And you're trying to deny it, channeling your killer instinct into something productive. But you can't change who you are in your bones. You're afraid of what's happened to you, of what you've become, and you're running from it. You need to give the monster an identity. It's only when the monster becomes someone else, something else, that you're free to be Oliver Queen. It was an excuse for me to murder people. Oliver, please. I put on a hood and I created a persona because John, somewhere please. along the way, something in me broke. Something is sick inside of me. Putting on this hood, it helps me direct the darkness inside of me. But at what cost? You're a fool to think a piece of cloth can separate man from monster. Dividing yourself in two can only make monsters stronger until it is stronger than you. How many people have you hurt? I don't know. How many people have you murdered? This deal you sold yourself on, but this hood is going to keep this monster of yours at bay. Someday it's going to fall apart. And when it does, you're not going to like the man you see underneath. You told yourself you kill because you have to. You confess, Oliver. You don't kill because you have to. So why? Why do you do it? I wanted to! And I liked it! Darkness and light are within you. In truth, you're only fighting yourself. Friends who fail. The people you kill. They have no place in this. Don't give in. Cast aside your darkness. Resist your darkness. You have any idea what you've done, huh? What you've done to all of us, to the people that you claim to care so much about? You've made us criminals. You've made us liars and victims. They told me that I ruined the lives of everyone that I come into contact with. Doesn't matter who they are. Doesn't matter how much I love them. It should have been me. Please wake up. I'm in their life. That life turns to ash. How many people can Oliver Queen lose before there is no more Oliver Queen? Oliver, the way you lead alienates everyone and everything around you. Look! Oliver Queen is a man destined to be alone. 
Oliver, you're still you. And if you're just doing this for you, like you just admitted. I didn't say I was doing it just for myself. This isn't 100% for our city. Then you are not the hero and it deserves. You, Mr. Queen, are not a hero. And you never will be. You're a villain. But you know that, don't you? I just want to do the right thing. The right thing? Is that what you were doing? Running around in that costume. You turned the law into a joke. The Green Arrow's very existence invited criminals into your city. You think you're some kind of hero. Have you ever stopped to think? Maybe all you've done is make things worse. We were in the field against Dinah, Curtis, and Renee. He pulls a gun on me. You think he gave me a choice? I think that you leave a trail of bodies every damn place that you go. Do what I do, Barry, it takes conviction. But more often than not, it's the will to do what's ugly. Every time I do that, I'm, I'm trading away little pieces of myself. You've convinced yourself that everything you've been through took away your humanity. But I think it's because of your humanity that you made it through. You wouldn't have survived, much less come out the other end a hero. Somebody who wants to do good, if you didn't have a light inside of you. Because being the Green Arrow is what makes you feel complete. For some reason, when you, you put that hood on it, it enables you to become the best version of yourself. When you told me I could inspire people, you said you could. But you were wrong. You can't inspire. What I know, Oliver, is that you started something. Something strong enough to live on past you. The life that I've chosen. No way, It only ends one way. Death comes for us all. We can only evade it so long. I could not be more proud. You become. Something else. You ordered the deadly fighting, and you are not done fighting. I know I called you a murderer, but you are not. You are a hero. You saved my life. You gave me purpose. This time we had to save you. I know who you are in your bones, Oliver. And that person doesn't give up. This is your responsibility now. Ollie, come on. You've cheated death more than any of us have by this point. I'm at peace. The essence of heroism is to die so others can live. Oliver Queen wasn't just a hero. He was a good man. He was an honorable person. The fact that he didn't start out that way makes him, in my book, even more honorable. He stands as a reminder to all of us that anyone can change.